Today I'm going to give you an inside look at the design story behind the Polk Signature Series. Whenever we start a new speaker series, we always look back at our history. We've been doing this for 40 years, and I think people expect the very best from us. One of the things I always notice when I look at some of our vintage ads is that Polk's always been known for giving an amazing sound at a really affordable price. This is my favorite vintage ad, facepalm. Bought expensive speakers, better not listen to ours. So when we started this series, we thought, how can we bring even more value to a Polk series? This whole series is below $1,000 a pair. And one of the first things we wanted to do was to bring the power port to this price point, which had never been done before. The cool thing about the power port is that by smoothing out the air turbulence in a port with this kiss shape, it actually adds 3 dB of bass. It's a really nice, clean, accurate bass without distortion. We also wanted to upgrade our classic soft dome tweeter. So we used new materials, we're able to create a frequency range that allowed us to be high res certified. And we want to celebrate that by uh, putting our, our 1972 established date and American Hi-Fi. For us, this concept of American Hi-Fi gets back to our founder, Matthew Polk, whose insight was speakers didn't sound like a live concert experience. And, and he wanted to bring a live sound home. And that led us to start to look at acoustic instruments. We started looking heavily at acoustic guitars and their shapes and materials, how they're built. And I think this, uh, this inspiration, you know, looking at instruments uh, more than, than other speakers, led to a really unique shape for the speaker. Uh, you know, most, most speakers are, are simple boxes and we wanted to have a really iconic shape from the front view of the speaker. So we took those really rounded edges um, from the acoustic guitar and brought those to the silhouette of the speaker. We also looked at the guitar and the way that the, the grain wraps around the edge of the guitar, very different than a typical speaker. And so we wrapped the grain 360 degrees around the speaker, um, you know, from the sides to the top, around to the bottom. The next thing we did is as we integrated the power port, um, we, we brought it to the bottom of the speaker. In our RTI series, uh, it's on the back of the speaker. We moved it to the bottom so the speaker can be placed more easily. Uh, it increased bass, performs better because we have a larger surface area there. And we also brought this nice metal badge to the front of the speaker. As we started building out the rest of the driver complement on the motorboard, we started to think, well, how can we go back to the guitar again? Um, and so, so one thing we notice on every guitar, obviously, is a pick guard, a really glossy, shiny uh, detail on the front of the, of the guitar. And we wanted to bring that to the front of the speaker. Um, also on the guitar uh, are the metal tuning hardware. So we brought these, these exposed metal hardware that holds that pick guard inspired plate down. Uh, it also acts as a magnetic anchoring for the magnetic grill. Um, and then the lines of the fretboard we used to kind of connect those magnetic hardware together. As we built out drivers on this series, we used a concave polypropylene driver with a custom molded surround that gives us the maximum excursion. Lastly, we added these rather beefy feet and the shape of this feet are specially designed so that they actually will anchor into a carpet or work great on a hardwood floor. So here you can see how we brought those three key details in, the power port, uh, the soft dome tweeter, and all the guitar detailing. And I think the resulting product is really unique, especially uh, at these price points. And I think uh, it feels more like a piece of furniture in the home um, and just really iconic and unique. That's the behind the scenes design story on the Polk Signature Series. I hope you enjoy these speakers as much as we do.